Hey, what is up my beautiful people? So apparently some people didn't know about this. I mean, I knew about this, but apparently there were some people that didn't know about this. I mean, I came across it while browsing online. But did you guys know that some Pokemon cards are connected with each other? Pretty much what I mean by that is like, you'll take like a certain Pokemon artwork and then combine it with another Pokemon artwork and it makes like one big illustration, like one big artwork just by combining Pokemon cards. Did you guys know that? I mean, it's pretty interesting and it's kind of interesting to see like when you do have a Pokemon card and you see like for example you see like Pikachu in the Pokemon card and then you'll see like um, I don't know like Mew's tail like in the corner you kind of like why is Mew there and then you pick up the Mew card and they connect with each other it's really interesting pretty cool and yeah I guess some people didn't know about that I thought it was pretty common knowledge but I guess it's not so let me give you guys some examples so one of the more popular sets of like the narrative illustration cards narrative illustration meaning all these cards come together to make one big artwork the most popular one in my opinion i think it's the most popular one is the southern islands set so if you pick up cards from the southern island set it's pretty obvious that all the pokemon illustrations are connected and there are even like we buy like the like the binders and stuff you'll see the illustration like the full illustration and how the pokemon cards are connected with each other i mean here's some examples just so you guys can kind of see and get an idea so southern islands is the most popular one because it's very obvious and they actually provide like if you pick up like the binder and stuff they actually provide you with the artworks you could compare and contrast so let's look at some of the least popular ones now some people have tried to combine like some cards like trying to try and reach kind of like reaching like base set hitmonlee and hitmonchan like trying to combine those two like those two don't really combine but some people have tried to like say like no they do combine like there's like they're obviously the same art the background isn't this really the same but you could you can make it work but that's reaching let's actually look at some actual ones so neo let's look at the neo pokemon cards because the neo the neo like revelation and neo and destiny those actually did have a lot of cards that did combine and one of the more cooler ones was Neo Discovery from the Neo Discovery set Eevee, Espeon and Umbreon so if you bought these cards in Japan and bought them in the binder you'll see that the art obviously does combine but if you bought it in America the English set it's a little bit less obvious but if you see all three cards do combine and it's the Evolutions, Eevee, Espeon and Umbreon all chilling in the ruins pretty cool right all right so another card combination from the Neo Revelation set is Lugia, Ho, and Skarmory. So at first, when I first saw it, I saw Lugia and Lugia. You see like Ho right there in the corner. And when I first saw it, I thought it was kind of strange. I'm like, why is Ho just chilling in the corner? Is it just kind of like a small special appearance of Ho, you know, trying to make like a little cameo or something? But no, I later found out that it actually does combine with another artwork, the Ho artwork, and then the Skarmory artwork also combines with that because the Skarmory artwork has Ho in the corner and it just makes one big beautiful art. What do you guys think? Another one from the Neo Revelation, the same said Neo Revelation, Raiko, Entei, and Suikun. And that's how those three combine. What do you guys think of that? Do you guys think it's pretty cool? Another one from the Neo series that I actually did find out about just like a couple days ago is the combination of Celebi, Suruwuru, and Sneasel. And that one, when you first look at the cards individually, they seem like they don't combine with anything, but they actually do. And it looks beautiful, right? What do you guys think? So let's look at some of the more popular modern ones. In modern ones, if you buy the Crown Zenith set and you pour like a God Pack, a God Pack, it means that all the cards that you pull are illustration rares. You'll see that the more obvious ones of the God Pack, obviously all the illustrations, the nine illustrations being, you know, Pikachu, Bidoof, Paris, all nine Pokemon combined to make one big illustration. That one is pretty obvious and it's obvious because if you pull the God Pack, the nine cards, they're all obviously connected. Pretty cool, right? And then the last one, the last one that I want to share with you guys for today is from the, the recent modern set, Pokemon 151 from that set. So if you look at Char Charizard, the illustration rare Charizard, Charmeleon, and Charmander. That one is beautiful because it shows Charmander chilling at the bottom of the canyon, Charmeleon making his way up, and then Charizard flying. Squirtle, Wartortle, and Blastoise shows Squirtle chilling on top of the beach, Wartortle taking a dive, and then Blastoise chilling in the deep, deep ocean. Beautiful. And then Venusaur, Ivysaur, and Bulbasaur. Bulbasaur kind of like hiding away in the grass, Ivysaur coming out showing his leaves, and then Venusaur out in the big beautiful open forest showing what he's about those right there i think they're all very beautiful illustrations especially when they combine together and especially if you buy like this type of like slab plastic covering that extends the artwork so you could kind of see how it works really cool huh so yeah, i just kind of want to share this with you guys you know just talk about these narrative illustrations that apparently some people don't know about but you know it's kind of cool to see and you know even me i didn't know about some of the narrative illustrations like i knew about some of them but i didn't know about like all of them and it's kind of 
kind of cool to see which ones exist out there because there's a ton of them. But anyway, let me know what you guys think of this video. Let me know if you guys want to see another video like this of me just sharing these narrative illustrations so I can share them with you guys because I think they're pretty cool and who knows, maybe there's some illustrations that you guys have never seen of like Pokemon combining because there is a lot out there that we don't know about that you wouldn't think it, right? But anyway, thanks for watching and I'll talk to you guys in the next one, right? Peace out.